Okay, so I'm going to teach you how to make wait, I need to go on Instagram. This This one. But I'm gonna put like a little twist on it. And this was from requested by the Fanta account. Yeah, but this is requested by her. Well, my dope right now is requested by. Anyways. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so what you're gonna need to go is on Pixar. If it's gonna load, and then you can follow the plus sign. And then you can go collage, grid. And then you're gonna find this one, I don't know, that's the one I used for mine, and I really liked how it looked, so I'm just going to go with that one again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, okay, so you're going to need 8 pictures for this edit, but I used 10, I got 10 just in case I didn't like how one came out, because usually that happens to me, so I'm going to choose those two, and another one, but I'm going to put on pause for that. Okay, so I got my picture, so I'm just gonna make, I don't like how the border is, like for me, I hate borders on my pictures, but that's personally me, and then I'm just gonna add a filter on this, I don't know what filter yet. I'm sorry about my voice, my voice keeps on going from like, kind of like scratchy, and it annoys me too, trust me. Probably just gonna do this one. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just gonna save the so I'm just gonna leave that. Okay, now that I'm on here, I'm gonna open up my photos. And go to Pixar and click that one. There's my background. So, what I'm gonna do is put like the circle things right here. I don't like how that came out though. It's kind of lopsided. Anyways, I'll fix it. No. Well, I'll make it look good at least. Try to. Okay. So, which photos did I use? I used the two roses. For me, it doesn't matter what picture I use for the background. Because I just take this circle thing and I just take out of the picture what I want. And then there. That's all I do what I want in the photo. For me, personally, when I do a photo like this, I like it better with like, kind of like flowers in it. Because I feel like it makes it more like, kind of like more romantic. In a way, you could say. I don't know, that's just personally my opinion. Because it looks kind of like, like a romantic edit. So, for me, I feel like more reds, more reds, <laughs> reds will look really nice with this. Why is everything coming out lopsided to me? That's not just me, right? It looks lopsided. No, it's a perfect circle. Hmm. Maybe. 
this is gonna hurt. I think that's gonna bother me though. Okay, what I'm trying to do here, I'm trying to, to get it on him, but I'm trying not to hit the corner either. Because I know if it hits the corner, it's going to annoy me. I'm really hoping that it did not hit the corner. I need to full circle. Nope, it hit the corner. Okay. So I'm just going to go in with all these different colored circles. I'm just gonna try and fix them up a bit. That one kind of blends in too much on my side, so I think I'm gonna switch it to this side. I'm just gonna try and fit that in there, but it has to be bigger than the others because this is at the bottom, so it's okay if this one cuts off a little bit. only thing I really don't like about this app is this part because see where it en ends that's where like it actually ends like it doesn't actually trick you like how other things are like it actually ends right there like it ends like at the edge see it ends right there and it looks like there's more so like you put like it you put it there and it's like oh I have more space but you actually really don't it's just that space right there I think I'm going to put that one as the bottom one. I'm not recommending this, you guys. If you guys are going to do this, you, I suggest you guys do from top to bottom. But I really like how that one looked on the bottom, so I'm just going to go with that. And what I'm doing is that I'm dragging the shadow over here so that it kind of looks more lifted. See, it looks kind of more lifted. As you can tell, that circle is bigger than this circle, but my face is perfect. Okay, so I'm going to come back and I'm done with the two other circles. And then we're going to go and put the quilt. Okay, so I have my quilt. So I'm just going to put my picture in. If it wants to. Okay, so I have my text now. Now I'm just going to edit the font I want. So when I'm done with the font, I'm going to come back and show you my color arrangements. Okay, for my color scheme, I'm going to go to red to black. And I already have that color scheme, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I already have this color scheme. I suggest whenever you do like a dark color, you do like a light stroke for them. It like pops out. You see that? That how it pops out. So that's what I'm gonna do for the basic text. I'm gonna come back when the edit's finished. Okay, guys. So this is the final product. It says the stupid smile I'll get when my thoughts get filled with you, and that's the final product. We'll just keep on moving. So, anyways, I hope you guys like. Please like, subscribe, comment. And if you didn't, please comment below why you didn't like it. And I'm going to try and make more Pixar edits.
because I know not everyone has super impulse, so comment below if you want me to use Pixar more often. So, yeah. Bye, guys.